Hello everyone and welcome to Kwandai Nation. Today I am going to be showing you how we're going to get our um, welcome sign. This is going to be a two-sided sign. One side going to have welcome and then the other side going to have joy. But I'm just going to show you how I'm going to DIY that because I've been seeing these in the um, stores for about 30 bucks. So I went ahead, I know I can do it, or at least I think I can do it. I'm going to go ahead and prepare this piece of wood right here. This is a 5 by 12 piece of wood, or should I say 2 by 5 by 12 piece of wood that I got from the Home Depot, and I'm going to be using it to do our DIY. Well, stay tuned as we go through this process. I'm about to sand the wood before staining it so let's get started we also have our letters that have been painted and they are drying out yep we got our letters but I'm working outside today you hear a lot of noises from the road so I apologize for that we will continue I started sand in this wood and we're going to continue with that for a little more maybe just a little one more round I'm gonna get my piece of rag and just wipe it down. Wipe all that dust off of it. And that's all I'm gonna do to this wood. And for right now, and then I'm gonna put a layer of steam on it. So I got some wood steam and in the color ebony that I'm going to be using to stain my wood and I'll be using a piece of microfiber rag to do that I'm just lightly brushing that on there lightly I don't want it to be too dark I don't want it to be too light so I am gonna lightly just lightly put that on there I think I like how it looks so far I've completed staining the wood and I think so far I like how it looks we're gonna wait for this to dry and the letters to dry and we will be back with the finishing of this project so since we completed our staining and sanding and steel and staining yes uh, we completed it and this wood is dry the steam is dry we are going to place our letters I'm just going to eyeball the measurements so if you like you can get out your tape measurement or your ruler or whatever and measure but I'm not going to measure anything I'm just going to place it by eyeballing there you go we've placed the letters 
and this is what it's gonna look like so I'm gonna get the glue and stick it on there I have some Gorilla Glue that we'll be using today Gorilla Glue we're gonna stick the wooden letters to the board We'll stick the wooden letters to this board kind of just This thing has a little nozzle and it, it, it's good. It's comfortable using this. So I'm going to do this with all the letters. And let it dry. Softening, gluing everything down. Now I'm gonna. I don't just want the welcome. I wanted to put on there welcome, hello, and welcome to our home. So I have the welcome in wooden letters. I'm gonna draw out the hello and the rest of the things I want to put there. But then I bought. I have this little home sign that I got from the Dollar Tree. I'm gonna glue it on there as well. I'm going to draw out the letters and then we will see what it looks like. Just going over the layers. Make sure they come up better than it look right now. I hope. I'm going to use the smaller brush and go over them, but I'm going to let it. Um, let them dry for a little bit and then I'll do a second thing with a smaller brush.
yes so after going over all the letters this is what we have I don't know if you approve but we will show you the finished project after the dry so we're gonna leave them to dry for a little bit 